Hello everybody, my name is Rebecca Grace and today we are going to talk about adding a fourth style into your headings. So right now in Squarespace you have three, heading one, two, and three, but there may be times you want a fourth option for headers. So for example, in my blog, I have um, my heading three throughout my website, a certain color, but when it comes to my blog, there's sometimes I don't want it to be a color. I just want it to be a black or a gray. And you may come across that yourself where you just feel like you need a fourth option for your headings. So this is how you add in a fourth heading option. The first thing you need to do is actually just add in, you know, the text, what you want your heading to be. So I'm going to go to edit and wherever you want your fourth heading to be, you're going to insert a code block. Okay, so not a text block. We're going to scroll down to more and we're going to insert a code block. Now in the code block, very simple, you're just going to write the text that you want in between heading four tags. So H4, and you'll see another one will pop up. You want your text to be between these tags. Click apply. Once you have the text, that you want to be your heading for, you have to style it. So what you're going to do is first go into design, site styles, okay. click on one of the headings that you want it to most look like. So for instance, if I want it to be exactly like heading three, but I want it to be this blue color. So I'm gonna click into heading three and I'm going to take note of everything that's in here. So this is the font family name, the font weight, the size, the spacing, if it's uppercase, lowercase, or none, the height. And I'm also going to take note of the color. So if I want it to be this blue color, I'm gonna copy and or write down what this code is. So once you know what you want it to be styled like exactly, you're going to go into design down to custom CSS and you're going to copy and paste the following code. Okay. And you'll notice it's popped up. It looks exactly like my heading three, but it's this blue color. And this is how I did that. I took each of those things I noted down and changed or altered this to match. So the, I put the font family name in here. You do have to add this part and that is the font type. So you may have to Google your font family name and see whether it is a serif, sans serif, monospace, whatever the type is and that goes here. You have the weight, the size, the spacing, you know, if it's uppercase, lowercase or none the line height. This is where I copied that color. And then I added in text align center because I wanted it to be here. But if you want it, you know, on the left, type left, if you want it on the right, you put right. Okay. And that is how you make a fourth heading option for your Squarespace website.